Well, hey everybody, we're back in the creepy basement. Uh, hopefully it's not as creepy as it was before, now that there's lighting. It's nothing magical, but it's, you know, it's better than it was. Let's put it that way. It's no longer, I'm no longer hidden in shadow. Although maybe you prefer it that way. I'm not going to say anything. It's hurt my feelings, why don't you? Well, ladies and gents, we've got a new series on our hands. We do. <coughs> I'm still sick. If you read the blog at all, you know that recently I finally, finally, got a record player. It's sitting right over here. It's within reach. It's shiny. It's new. It's functional. <gasps> It's amazing. Uh, in any case, I also got on my hands a very large collection of vinyl records. Uh, I think you can see them. Hey, can you see the stacks? We got stacks on stacks here. Uh, not all of it is great, but a lot of it is actually pretty good. Uh, and also, I've just I've started buying vinyl. Uh, basically, one a week, essentially, kinda basically one a week, uh, and so I decided to do a once a week vinyl series. Let's call it Vinyl Tuesday. Cool. <laughs> All of a sudden I have a title for it and everything. It's great. So this week we are going to start off with an absolute <gasps> classic, and uh, even though the sticker says five on it, uh, I actually bought this for a dollar, if you can believe it. Uh, and considering I paid a dollar for it, the condition is awesome. Well, wow. Tears for Fears, Songs from the Big Chair. Classic. Just, a, just an absolute classic. Uh, this is the one with Everybody Wants to Rule the World. I believe Shout is the first, uh, uh, is the first track on the first side, on side A. Uh, Head Over Heels is another good one. Uh, but yeah. Tears for Fears, this one, this is one that was a must-get. Like, so I got the, uh, the record player, and I knew that there was a place out there that sold $1 vinyls, and I went there with my dad, it was awesome, there's a blog post about that, and, uh, it was one of those ones where I found a stack of about six of these, uh, in the $1 section. And I was, I was, it wasn't even a question. Didn't even pop into my mind that it was a question. I checked all six and uh, just checked to see which one was in the best condition. This was the one, and it's amazing. It's awesome. Uh, I absolutely love it. It was absolutely worth more than the dollar that I paid for it, but hey, whatevs. And here's the thing about vinyl that uh, that I talked about in the blog post that maybe you youngins don't understand, but one of the things that, that really gets me about vinyl is that it's... the song is physically etched into, or pressed, whatever, uh, is, is physically here. This is, this is physical music right here. And to play it, you drag a needle across it at varying rates of speed, uh, and then the music comes out. It is, it's the physical music is here, and it's a little bit dirty, you know? It, feel, it just feels a little dirty. Uh, it feels one step closer to being uh, in the room with the guys, playing the music, and uh, yeah. I love it. It's awesome. All right, so there you go. Vinyl Tuesday number one, Tears for Fears. They are amazing. Uh, I believe they're actually still touring. I don't know. I'll have to double check that. If they are, I want to go see them. Uh, but in any case, yes, Tears for Fears, Songs from the Big Chair, uh, a must-have on anybody's list. And uh, yeah, now I have it. Awesome. So, I hope you guys are having a good week. Happy Tuesday. Peace.